This is part of our investigation of Nevada State Prison that didn't make the final cut for the Paraflix episode. Now here's the history and investigation of the women's cell block, one of the most haunted locations in Nevada State Prison. This is the women's, so um, they were housed here until the 50s. 1950, and then they were moved into their own prison. The women's detention area is one of the most active in the entire prison. There is a massive shadow entity nicknamed the Blob that can constantly be seen there. And the spirits here can be very violent towards men. Here's Johnny. We went right out of the fire and into the furnace. We immediately started an investigation of the women's cell block. This isn't scary at all. Is this scary? Is this is what you find there. You know what? He was telling me that people see um, things come out of the hallway here. Well, it's just water on the left. Is what he was saying. This one, the exit, or was it? He thought you said there was a. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's where she saw the blob. Oh, this is it. Yeah, it is we need to... I think we need to have her come up. Because this was it right here. Is this women's prison? Women's cellar. They don't like men. And apparently they don't really care about me either. Holy shit. It's really strange. Where are you guys in here? Ladies, I just heard someone go. Rah. Are you here? I just like it better with the light. Is that weird? Are you behaving? Was that one of you guys? Mandy? What's up? Eight. I heard. Do you like the wind? That is strong. Hey, um, we're up in uh, the women's. Yeah, if you want to come up. So ten. Cell 10. Hello. I don't know much about you, but hope you're here. That's Mandy. <laughs> oh my god. What? But Mandy was in the cell. I saw oh, I saw like a seven foot tall figure standing down there. I have my camera, hopefully it'll see it. I thought you were standing down there, I'm like, that's too tall to be Mandy, and then you came out of the cell. Oh, no. 
It was before. It was before I turned the... Are you okay down there? Um... I'm coming down. So Brian thought he just saw a huge shadow figure and had his camera right on it, and it didn't show up. Just like I thought I saw something in the glass, and my camera was right on it, and it didn't show up. Does that mean spirits don't show up on camera? At this point, we're waiting on Susan and Chris to join us in the women's section of the prison, and I felt kind of an obligation, because of my fear, to start a spirit box session to make contact with the other side. Not the most scary I've ever seen, Stephen. Yeah, I told them, I told them, I was like, I don't think I've ever seen him. I mean, I've only seen it in a few times, but... Yeah, I mean, I don't think I've seen it in a few times, but... Is this the ladies section of the prison? Why are we put here? What? Angel? Sorry. Wait. I think he was speaking to the Stephen show. Sure. But I was that's Steven, but I thought I saw like a person. Yeah, it's you. Steven! Steven! Yeah. We just saw a shadow outside your cell block. What do you want to tell me? Thank you. Very clear. Very clear. Thank you. Thank you for what? For just coming? Hey, come here and look at something. Huh? Let's look at this. It looks like, why does it suddenly look like there's a fucking, just a black curtain on down there? And the came out and it's just so black all over. Way too black. If this isn't Stephen, I'm gonna shit my pants. Well, I was walking down, and it just said, hey. And I said, yes, and it said, come in. And I came in and said, thank you. We saw a very dark, tall figure standing outside the sidewalk. Okay, pretty much looked like it was the same thing I saw standing out here. Yeah. See now, Mandy? Now look, I look down that hall. This light on, and I can see, I can see all the way to the end. It was completely black. It was, yeah, there was definitely something standing there. Well, I was in there. Yeah. But come here and look at something. Huh? Just look at this. It looks like, what is it? And then you couldn't see the end of the hall. It was completely black. Leave your head out! Let me see you! Susan, I'm right here. We're right here. At this point, Susan and Chris join our investigation. Here is so weird. I have an hour box. It was a Stephen. Stephen. Stephen was down in cell ten, mm -hmm. and it looked. First, we saw that the figure there, and then I looked back again, and right, you could see some light coming out of the cell from Stephen. Yeah. But it was like there was a black curtain, and you couldn't see to the end of the hall. And now, if I turn on my light, the same light, you can see all the way to the end of the hall. 
this is some of what we're talking about. If you notice, I'm walking down this hallway, but there is a black mass keeping the light from my IR light shining further down the hallway. And if you notice, there's nothing in front of me. I should be able to shine my light all the way to the end of this corridor, but I can't because there is a black mass keeping my light from shining any further. Just my hand your laser. I do have my laser. Oh, there Take the grid off your laser and shoot the single beam okay. straight down. Can someone, I've got too many pieces Here. of equipment in my hands. Okay. Man, can you take my camera? Oh my God. So we're talking, Mandy, and I looked, and I saw someone standing right here, and they went this way. Go through the wall. Okay, can you turn it back on? She At this point, I'm alone in cell number 10, while Brian and everyone else finishes setting up the single laser beam experiment. Can you see that beam? Set between it. What was that? Make the beam go out. Something's definitely dimming it. Yeah. Can't set walking in front of it, huh? I'm in cell 10. Steven, you're not at the end of the hall? No. I'm in cell 10. I just saw a full figure at the end of the hall and I thought it fell. Oh. And I thought it was you. That's what I chased. Saying no matter whichever end of the hall we're at, it's at the other end. Okay. Mandy, where are you? Do you want to go to the other end? I'll go to the middle. Brian, stay here. There's a... Shut it back. There's a... F fuck. Step out, please. We already know you're here. It's all right. Share yourself with us. Hey, now it's not hitting again, is it? My camera is not focusing or something. My house had different issues with that too. It's not standing in front of it. Oops, sorry. Um, okay, let's, uh, let's face out and see what we can do. Uh, Susan, how are you feeling? Uh, dizzy. Now, Susan and I can sense you and feel you. So you don't need to use our bodies or our energies. You can just visually show us, audibly tell us instead. Oh, 
He's standing oh. down there. Oh! He's standing down there. Into the hall. There he is. Do you see that? Uh-huh. Oh my god. He's standing there. Standing. With his legs out. Fuck. Where? At the end of the hall. <gasps> right? Oh my god. He's oh big. my god. He's he big. is huge. Holy shit. I can't fucking focus on him. <gasps> oh my god. Where? You see him? Right by you, Brian. He's walking. To <gasps> He's standing oh. down there. Oh. He's standing down there. Into the hall. There he is. Do you see that? Uh-huh. Oh my god. He's standing there. Standing. With his legs out. Fuck. Where? At the end of the <gasps> Right? Oh my god. He's oh big. my god. He's he big. is huge. Holy shit. I can't fucking focus on him. <gasps> oh my god. Where? You see him? Right by you, Brian. He's walking. That's Brian. No, we saw a full we figure. I saw that, figure. but the full figure oh. was huge. Where were you seeing it? Because down, down, down here. I was seeing this whole area and wasn't seeing anything. No, down that, down oh, on oh, your side. Down by me. Yeah, yeah. down by you. Yeah, that, that certainly wasn't me. It was no. huge. It was big. Huge. He was standing. He no, was standing, standing, standing like, like this. this. He was standing, standing like this. Yeah, yeah. standing. Yeah, because I, I was in, I was in the, the other the door. Hall. I was in the doorway all the way. Right the all the way. And, and this is where people get sickness. And I was going to say, where are you going? Where are you? Yeah, I saw the whole body. Not, not, I know Brian moved his face. Yeah. It was yeah. Like yeah. moving. It was like almost no. fighting uh, in his boots. Yes. Like not yet. Yes. Like trying to. Well, it couldn't have been me because I was literally standing in this doorway with my elbows braced on either side. See, there's no way he could, and it was taller than him. It was taller than him for sure. I mean, clear as this, this is where I was and the whole time. That, no, it was standing there. Okay, turn, let's. So it was basically standing where Stephen is? You were standing, you were standing there? Turn off the flashlight. I was standing right here. Right here. On this side. On this side. On this side. No, on the other side. On the other so side. Where, so we saw where Steven's standing. Steven's right here, right here. And it was further up. And he was And he was tall, like to the ceiling. Well, I'm saying that's the thing I saw was almost to the ceiling. Okay, that's what we saw. And he had legs spread out. And as soon as you started moving, it was almost like he started trying to hide within your movement. It was wild. Okay. I'm gonna pull out the spare box. Okay. I'm gonna pull out the spare box really quickly because I think we got something going on over here. I need to take it from here. Okay. I feel like he wants to have me go to the right, and now I'm getting emotional because somebody's here with us. Mm -hmm. You guys don't don't be so hard on her. She's your backbone. She's, She's your always backbone. with you. Elizabeth, are you here, Lizzie? You can talk to us through this device. Is it a little kid? Sebastian. Did you hear him cough? Yeah, it was a kid cough. Sebastian just left. I can. I, I feel like he just left.
It taught us why people are afraid of the dark. Now, make sure you head over to Paraflix and watch the full investigation of Nevada State Prison. Follow the link tree in our bio for all links to Paraflix and use promo code HPD10 at checkout. This is Nevada State Prison. This is the most active investigation any of us has ever been on. This is where the sun don't shine. A place that even with a flashlight... Can you touch this device again? You can't see two feet in front of your face. Oh, yeah. oh my god, that's clear! <laughs> Hollywood paranormal detectives thought we had seen the dark. Face with like white hair like... Scooby-Doo ghost in that Ooh. Ooh. But the dark is much darker here. Yeah, they always suggest against letting a murder murder into your body. Too late. <laughs> this is Nevada State Prison.